So Reddit shut down the discussion about this card. I think it did so unfairly. It seems that people are not allowed to talk about things in Magic the Gathering. One of the reasons I hate Magic the Gathering so very much is its community. In my opinion, when you have a different opinion, you should be able to share it and communicate and learn from each other. That's the only way you can learn. Even if somebody is wrong, I want to see their side of the view. I want to see like their opinion because I think we can all share our opinions, learn from each other, see our perspectives, and come out with something new that we didn't know before. Uh, I take an uh, example for one example is there was an African American who went to you know these meetings, um, triple letter meetings, <laughs> starting with a K, and he was able to educate and show, hey, I'm just an ordinary guy, like you guys, like there's nothing to fear. And he was able to really convert a lot of people who were racist into non-racist. And be like, oh, I understand you better. In our society today, as soon as things get a little tough, the moderators ban people. They close the discussion on this card, which is what they did on Reddit. On the main Reddit, uh, it was closed almost immediately, right? Given the, quote, discussion. And I don't think that's the way to do it. That's the same reason Democrats and Republicans, they can never get in their room and they're always disagreeing. And because they never have the ability to speak to each other with transparency and, hey, these are my cards, those are your cards, can we trade cards that we both need? So here we have a discussion. I'm not going to, you know, unless you're saying like something wild, I'm not going to shut down the discussion I think it is a discussion we need to have and it is worth having because this will not be the only time a character is maybe gender bent or race bent. I don't know if that is a word, but I know gender bent is a word that we use uh, that is used in a cosplay community, right? Uh, quite often. And I don't have I personally don't have an issue with this. I just find it a little strange that it's not a new character. Like in Lord of the Rings, the Amazon Prime version, the they just had new characters. The old characters like Gwendolyn, who was an elf. She was always a female white elf. She, be, she continued to be a female white elf. And the, the Dwarven lineage, right, from the Gimli's and so on, from the Hobbit movies, yeah, it, it matches um, the, you know, he was a white male, uh, white male, uh, dwarf who had a white male son named Gimli. So if you watch the Hobbit movie, they actually give, you know, a little bit Gimli to Lagonis, right? And Lagonis, again, it, it wasn't like, oh, he was um, a white male in the trilogy, but then in the Hobbit series, when he made a cat, when he appeared, it actually was way more, way more than a cameo, he became a black elf, right? <laughs> then we would be like, hmm, that's a little weird, right? It's a, is it the same dude? Is it a different dude? Is it, you know, so Aragon, who we know from lore and from movies as a white male, has now become a black male. And this is not a new story. This is not a multiverse type of situation, uh, which Marvel does a lot. This is more like, oh, huh. So what do you feel about that? You know, what do you feel about that? Um, it in my opinion, it would it would be similar to like let's take any uh, uh, Neo from the Matrix, and then in the new Matrix is the same Neo, but you know because the computer blah blah blah. Right now he's black. We'd be like oh, and then Morpheus is white now. And it's like oh, <laughs> but they're the same characters. Um, it, also it would be very similar to like let's say. Um, and Magic Jace became black. Would anyone care? I don't think so. But at the same time, I don't think people have that much close affinity. The one thing you have to know about Lord of the Ring nerds, I, I use that term very lovingly, is that they're very strict and by the book. By the book. So they might be more offended than if you made Jace black when Aragon is black, 
they may be far more offended by that because of the lore and the books and the token and you know they're, they're somewhat extremist right in terms of uh fantasy gaming well most magic players are just more loosey-goosey okay whatever right i just want the most powerful card i don't care if it's a you know vampire or it's some type of like eight-legged spider shed raid right i don't care i just want to play the card anyway let me know in the comments below uh, what you truly feel about this. Are you offended? Are you not offended? If you are offended, why are you offended? If you're not offended, um, is there anything you can tell the people who are offended? So it is out of control. Uh, and that's why the moderators had to ban everybody because that's what moderators do best. Uh, they do not encourage discussion. They just make sure, you know, everything goes according to which of the coast so they can get some free promos. Anyway, let me know in the comments below. Hi, guys.